Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Previews. It is the last beer in this week's Northern Monk um, subscription box Odyssey. Six beers. Um, well, it's the last one. And if you've been following me all week, you'll know which one it is. If you follow me from Monday, <coughs> the unboxing and the first beer. Right through, you'll know what I'm left with. And I'm left with... This one. This is Mumps, Monk's Syrup Stack. It is a breakfast, it's a pancake breakfast stout coming in at 6%. Have a look at that. And we all know, if you are watching and you're in England, you know what this is meant to represent. Um, and I hope that this label does not get the monk into any, any kind of trouble. But it does look reminiscent of a certain brand of syrup, of golden syrup. Um, that rhymes with tat and leels. Anyway, it, it looks great. That, that looks great. It looks, it's trad for me. It looks brilliant. Um, it, it really just ticks the box for me. On the back, the back on the side here, it says, "Out of the north comes forth sweetness, a Canadian breakfast stout with hints of smoky bacon and syrup." Ooh, brewed with a smooth, brewed to be smooth with caramel sweetness. A traditional uh, pancake taste. Okay. I'll take that. Uh, best before is the 8th of no, uh, February 2024. It says that round here somewhere. You can read that. Um, if there's anything you need to know, then look at 2.6 units if you're interested. Uh, there's ingredients, water, malted barley, uh, gluten, oats, maltodextrin, hops, and maple flavour, and yeast. Okay. <coughs> Look what the old card says. It says here, we've mixed the flavours of Cajun breakfast, pan pancakes and sweet stout, into smokiness, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it's everything I've just read on the, on the back, I think. Uh, bum, 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 bum. Yeah, we've mixed it. We've, we've mixed the flavors of Canadian breakfast pancakes into into a sweet stout, with a hint of smoky bacon, maple syrup, and honey. Subtle flavors of roast coffee and bitter dark chocolate add to the sweet richness of this smooth stout with undertone notes of caramel. That's what it says. Now, let's put the top. And let's see what we've got. Use my another one pages project Tahu. Okay, so that's pouring. I don't know, maybe a little bit lighter than I thought it was gonna be. I'm hoping this was gonna I'm hoping it's gonna be thick. I hope it's gonna be heavy. But six percent, probably not. Anyway, beer and glass, what have we got? Jet black beer, and we've got ourselves just over a finger of tanned head. It looks lovely, it really does. Look fabulous. That ah, looks great. Let's get the nose so we can smell to go for it. I'm getting sweet milk chocolate, roasted malt, and caramel. Honey, syrupy, sweetness. Well, it maybe. On the nose, I'm kind of getting that that pancakey feel, pancake aroma, but maybe that's just my my brain playing tricks on me. Let's go for the budget carbonation. Cheers. That's not as thick as I thought it was going to be. Tasty. Well, I thought it was, I thought that was going to be thick and heavy. But mind you, six percent probably is probably never going to be like be thick and heavy, was it really? To be fair, um. So it's me. It's me, medium bodied. Carburation is, is is light. It's got a nice feel to it. It, it has. I mean, I say I was, I was just expecting it to be something a little bit, a bit more, but. I didn't carb wise, it's pretty good. Let's go for the big old taste. Cheers, my dears. I 
Smokes and Balls, Dark Chocolate, Coffee, certainly. Um, there's a sweetness to it, vanilla -y, um like a caramel sweetness. Back end, let me go again, because I thought I got smokiness. Yeah, there's a, there is there's a, there's, a, there's a nice smokiness to the back end of it, and it leaves your mouth it leaves your mouth dry. And there's a bit there's a, there's a certain leaves my mouth a little bit bitter. It's 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 tasty. It really is. It's very nice. I know when I give when I give this to Mrs. Beardard, she's gonna to say to me, "Too smoky for me." Uh, well, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Well, it's not a bad little not a bad little sound for six percent. It really is. It's, it's what an idiot! What an idiot! I have that with Dammy front. Um, yeah, it's 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 okay. It's good. It's nice. I think as I get into this, it'll probably get better and better. I think. Lovely. Like I say, bitter, sweet, roasty, smoky back end. It's lovely. Syrup, ah, maple. Oh, I don't know. I don't think. I don't think what this says on the back. On the back of here, um, delivers what it says in the can. If I'm being honest. Um, sweet stout, it's sweet. Hint of smoky bacon. Well, you kind of get that smokiness on the back end. And I, I tell you what, something. I, as you let this beer sit, so this is my last mouthful now. To now, you do that smokiness does come through. Um, so you take a sip, put your beer down. Leave it for a minute. Yeah, I'm getting I'm, I'm getting smokiness. But that's hanging around. Uh, hanging around. It took a while to develop. It is hanging around, but it took a while to develop. Do I like it? I do. It's okay. I thought this was going to be syrupy golden. Syrupy golden. Golden, syrupy, sweet, and it's not. There's maple in there. Yes. But it's it's mostly um, coffee, bit of chocolate, milk chocolate, that type of feel. It's nice though. Is it you get the illusion of pancakes in there? It kind of plays with your brain a little bit, which is nice. Makes you think. But hey ho, so let's wrap this review up. It's gone on far too long anyway, I do apologise. So this is another Monk's, Monk's Syrup Stack. This is a pancake breakfast stand at 6%. Do I like it? Yes. Would I buy it again? Yes. Would I recommend it to friends? Yes. Unfortunately, this beer has sold out. They found a couple of other cans and that went within hours of them saying this is available. Um, would I buy this again? I say, yeah, I would. Absolutely. If, if, yeah, I would. I would. If you've had this, let me know what you think. Please put a little comment in the comments box below. I will put a link to the Northern Monk website in the description box. As I say, unfortunately, you can't buy it. But there are other beers from this box. You can. Do that for the video. Do that if you don't. Subscribe down there. And I'll see you on the next one. Stay there. Stay safe. Hey, Leo.